guys, it's Saturday morning and um, we're headed to the other house. We're headed to the post office first because Marvin helped me with the mailer that I had to do. And he left his truck unlocked. And now we're gonna go drop that off at the post office and then we're gonna go to the other house and do some final, final countdown. No, we're gonna do a final load and just check on the, uh, did you bring a, um, something to clean the floor? Okay. Um, we're gonna do a final, final walkthrough. We had somebody clean, but um, kind of left. A, there's a film on the um, wood floor in the master, so we're gonna just kind of check that out, and see if we need to do anything with that. And I need to run to Costco. I need to run to the store to get some um, some. So, wow, it's dark. There we go. There I am. I need to get some food and such for the coming week. And then we're just gonna focus on putting the house back together. He's gonna probably figure out how to put his garage together or maybe how the TV works. So, fun things to do today. We are at Tom Thumb. Marvin needed an ad. I needed a hot chocolate. Are you gonna get something, honey? I'm gonna get a medium hot chocolate. Medium hot chocolate. Yeah. He, he means grande. So we were out here and we realized that we had not emptied our shed out. Um, it has wood in it and stuff, just miscellaneous wood pieces. So there's some good wood in there and I called my dad to tell him he can come over and get that. If he doesn't want that, it's okay if it stays. But there's like some pieces of drywall and stuff that are just like, and plywood and stuff that's just, yeah, cheap wood. So putting that out, Hey, hey guy. Yeah, so he's not happy. But uh, I'm gonna take all this out to the trash so the bulk trash people can pick it up and uh, yeah, get stuff done. All right, we just bought a sofa, a love seat. We bought a bench for the bedroom. We bought a bed, nightstand, and mattresses for the guest bedroom. We bought a rug for the living room and a chair from my office and oh the dining room table and we bought eight chairs because it's a big table so furniture check and i already showed you guys what the furniture looked like but if i can find pictures i'll insert in here but so that's done now we are at elliot's looking for a um light bulb and just other stuff while we're here Free beads and I didn't even have to do anything inappropriate for them. Just got to Tom Thumb and I'm picking up SOS pads for one thing because we need them and just some miscellaneous food stuff to get us through the weekend and I'm gonna prep, do food prep tonight, tomorrow, so I gotta make a list of stuff that we're gonna need for dinners and lunches and breakfast all next week. Hey guys, it Oh, <laughs> I was like, um, there's no one home and I'm hearing something, but it's the cats. So, I mean, Marvin's home, Marvin's in bed, he's asleep because it's late and I stayed up a little bit later doing wing mom stuff. I post for our main page on Facebook and so I was stayed up a little bit late prepping some posts for that. I try to post in advance so that way I have a little bit of we'll go room in my daily schedule and so anyway I did that we hauled one last load from the old house but as it turns out it wasn't the last load because my sign is there my realty sign is still there so I'll have to go get that and then I forgot my mom and dad went to El Paso so the wood that's in the shed if he's not if my dad is not going to be home like in the next <laughs> day and a half, then we'll go get that, put that in our garage, and then my dad can just pick what he wants and we'll keep the rest. So, because there's some good pieces of wood in there and he, he does a lot of woodworking and projects and stuff like that. Plus, I'm gonna make him, 
I'm going to make him kind of I'm going to make him I'm going to have him make me a Pottery Barn like inspired desk I saw a desk on Pottery Barn, Pottery Barn Teen and it basically is like a sawhorse desk it's just like a flat top with like sawhorse legs and so I'm going to see if he can't make that for me and because I want something like super simple so in my office I'll have to show you tomorrow because I've already got all the lights off and I'm not going back out there. But I'm going to put, I have a bookcase that my dad made me and I'm going to put that in the room. But I think I need to repaint it or at least paint it a fresh coat of white paint. It's already white with gold lettering. My dad wrote my name in gold. <laughs> I like paint. So anyway, it's from my childhood. So I thought I would um, paint it white, give it a, a fresh coat of white paint and also a fresh coat of the gold paint and because it's like got gold on anyway it doesn't matter details details right so anyway i'm going to repaint it i think and or give it a fresh coat and then put that in the room i haven't decided if i'm going to put it against one wall or another so maybe you guys can help me decide that or maybe i'll have my instagram fan help me decide that so uh, i'm going to do that and then i'm going to do um so I'll have the, trying to decide where to put the bookcase, and then I'll have my dad put, uh, put together a desk for me. It looks like it'd be really simple, but I don't do woodworking. I mean, but seriously, it looks like piece of wood, pieces of wood, pieces of wood. I mean, it doesn't look that hard. So I'm hoping my dad can make that pretty quickly for me so I can put that in my office because today we did get the furniture, and I've already showed you guys the furniture, but we got the couch and the love seat. We got a bench for the bedroom, and we got an off a desk chair for my office. It's not even a desk chair. It's just like an accent chair, a side chair, or something like that it's called. So that's for my office. And then, what else did we get? Oh, a table with eight chairs. And we got the bed for the guest room and we got a nightstand for the best bedroom so we got for the guest bedroom we got the headboard and footboard we ended up did we did end up getting that and the frame and the mattress and it wasn't the cheapest mattress either it was a it's a decent mattress so that when our guests come over they'll be comfortable and then we also got a nightstand so we can put a lamp on there and then what else did we do the only thing I'm really missing is like art pieces maybe um, is that I didn't have that much art in the old house and in this house I was really wanting some art pieces particularly the line drawings and I don't know if like if you seen like the one one line drawings where like it's just one continuous line so I'm kind of also into not like really nude sketches like I'm not like looking for anybody's body but just like outlines I don't know how to explain it but um, I don't know if I showed you guys yet what I was kind of looking at. But if I look at um, Pinterest tomorrow or my computer tomorrow, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. But it's just like simple line drawings. And they're not like, they're kind of like abstract, I guess you would call them. Art drawings. And so I was thinking about some of those for the bedroom. And then, or maybe for the master bath. And then for the bedrooms and like, I don't know, I'm in the laundry room right now. It's like, do I need a laundry room sign? I don't know. I mean, I kind of would like a laundry room sign. Is that broken? Looks broken. Oh, look, I can't reach it. I also have to get a step stool, like a sturdy one that goes kind of high, like two steps, because our cabinets are really tall in this house. Like, I, I mean, here, here's an example. So I'm in the laundry room. I can reach this cabinet. I can maybe sort of reach this cabinet, but that, that third shelf, not even happening not even close and so um even in well i can reach i can reach that top shelf that's not bad but there's other shelves in here i just i can't reach i mean i just couldn't i can't reach them at all so i'm just gonna get us or get me a step ladder that has like two steps i don't even marvin really couldn't even reach that so um i'm gonna get a step ladder and i saw one at bed bath and beyond but i don't know we might go to like Lowe's or something like that. 
And I did our budget and we do still have enough money to put up a fence, so yay for fences. Don't really have any extra money for landscaping, but I mean, you know, hey, step at a time, step at a time. So, um, looked up some houses tonight for some clients, got a commercial, a couple commercial clients, couple residential clients, and oh my goodness, I forgot to look up, I need to look up something really quick for a client. But anyway, so on that note, I'm going to let you go, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.